All right, hey everybody, welcome to stream. So tonight I am picking back up with the quarry, which I'm super excited for. Um, I have basically just been wanting to watch other people play this game. And so I wanna get back into it also just because it's fun for me to play and I'm excited to see what happens. So last time that I streamed, um, Basically, the game started off, and this is um, one of those, I don't know, like, kind of choose your own adventure. It's sort of like Until Dawn, or uh, Man of Medan, or the other games that they did, uh, Little Hope and House of Ashes, so it's my super massive games. Um, and so this is kind of like spooky horror movie at a summer camp. So uh, last time we started off with, I think it was Max and Laura and they were on their way to Hackett's Quarry for the summer because they were going to be new camp counselors. And they were actually going a day early. And at least... <clears throat> so they, they drove their car off um, the road accidentally into the woods. Uh, Laura did some, like, exploring around while Max fixed the car. And Laura went into the woods and she met this, like, spooky ghost lady. And there was something about, um, like, a a freak show or like a circus that had burned to the ground so not really sure what that's about but then a cop a super creepy cop came and helped them out and got them back on the road and he told them to go to a hotel but instead they decided to go to the summer camp anyway they ended up going into the basement of a building in the summer camp and i think for sure max ended up dying and for some reason, I think I thought Laura died as well, but apparently, or from what I'm thinking and what I'm remembering, she just got like stabbed in the neck with like a tranquilizer or something. So I'm not actually sure she's dead. Then the game has kind of like flashed forward to the end of summer camp. All the kids um, have left and the counselors are supposed to be leaving too. However, they have, um, one of the campers has intentionally sabotaged their vehicle to get out and they've decided to stay and party for the night. And the very last scene that we saw was these two hunters, I guess? They were like covering themselves in blood and they were tapping down a sign that said hunting season. So we're gonna go ahead and get back into it and see what comes up. So if I remember correctly, this should be chapter three, I think. Uh, sink Blair. Let's see. Or maybe just at the end of chapter two that we left off. I'm not sure how the game saves. <clears throat> oh, it was chapter two. Okay. So chapter two, truth or dare. So here we are, stranded in the great American wild with nothing but our wits to guide us. Will humanity prevail or... Will we grow ravenous and resort to eating the flesh of the deceased like I saw in that one tiny French movie? <laughs> Foreshadowing. Except we can't actually seem to get into the general Lay store. Jacob. Ooh. Rich and full body, this rare beefcake may leave an irritating taste lingering on the palate and acquire taste. So these two were dating for the whole summer until. Uh, the end of camp, and she broke up with him. <clears throat> Looks like you're trying to thread a needle with a packet of loose sausages. Oh my god, I'm almost done, okay? Jeez. Don't be mean to Jacob. <laughs> he seems sweet. Okay, I'm almost there. One second. Ah! Uh, nah, I'm not gonna kick the door. I believe in you, Jacob. There we go. There we go. <laughs> Viola. Uh, Your hair clip, madam. Yeah, you can keep it. It's not too shabby, huh? Yeah. Cute. Mm. Uh, let's be playful. I like a man who's good with his hands. Since they used to be. Uh, well, they call me Mr. <laughs> Magic Fingers. No, they don't. <laughs> okay. So, if I were a beard, where would I be hiding? This is a general store, but I feel like I assumed that it was part of the camp. How are you doing? Oh. <laughs> so I don't know if they would actually uh, have beer. So my beard are. Beard Helps me are. Some beers. Huh. How am I just noticing how super lame you are? What? But it, 
my beard are, dude. Mm. I'm just gonna He's cute. <laughs> Kids really wipe this place out. Mr. Yeah, see, that's what I was picturing like camp water bottles and crafting supplies and snacks and stuff, but I don't know if they would actually ooh, have beer at a children's summer camp. I think it's locked. <clears throat> So was the plan to just like <laughs> leave watermelons to rot all year long until the next summer camp? Party time. You just I mean, vodka right in it. Yes. Yeah. It's the most fun you can have with a hole in watermelon. <laughs> or, well, second most. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna leave you two alone and go look for some more party supplies. Okay, so it looks like we're finally in control. So one of the things, too, that we need to be on the lookout for is um, these tarot cards. I found one in the last chapter, and I watched a little bit of other people's videos, and I found out it was all dark and spooky. Um, I found out that I... Ooh, he scared me. <laughs> Sorry. I found out that I actually missed one um, somewhere in like the woods somehow. I think I took like a wrong turn or didn't explore everything. What's this? Something I can push? Is it like a rolling shelf? No, it's a caged area. Nothing terrifying about that. Ooh, okay. No, this is not a tarot card. <laughs> I got so excited yes, I thought it was. Yeah. So Harem Scarum is the, we found a poster for that in the woods in like the prologue chapter. So Freak Show Flyer, buy tickets now. This is pretty much I think the same exact poster that we saw in the woods. Um, and this is fine and there's nothing, nothing spooky happening over here. at all so during the like intro or I guess like prologue chapter um, ooh moccasins no not moccasins wood carvings for a second I thought they were moccasins it's just <gasps> seem comfortable okay can she go see it can she see that he's out there no oh I hate this oh I hate this Oh, I didn't think that, like, the spooky stuff was going to start quite this er early. Those are chair legs. Um, what is that? Toothpaste? I feel like the second I go in the cage, uh, things are happening. Is he, like, out there? Ugh. <laughs> oh, here's something. Ooh, that's oh. gross. Hello, old <clears throat> friends. Oh yeah. Oh no. Uh, yeah, scare Jacob just because it seems funny. <laughs> like this. Okay. Have y'all ever seen a grown man crap his pants? Cause you're about to. I feel like this is something she would do. Mm -hmm. Oh my. All right, now where should I hide? Jacob! Emma? <laughs> That's her name, oh. Emma. I'm struggling a little bit with remembering everybody's names. Look, if you're trying to scare me, it's not going to work. Mm hmm. That's what you think, Jacob. That 
is a terrifying mask. You don't a cold? No, they're they're funny. You think this is supposed to be funny? <laughs> I mean, yeah. <laughs> well, you think it's funny Ooh. now, little boy? I oh, because you want to join plenty of my sexy clown friends in a tiny car that somehow fits us all like it's no big deal. <laughs> This really sounds sexy. What? Moment's gone. <laughs> oh, I forgot. Okay, well, at least maybe he's like closer to us in case anything happens. Can we look at the spider though? Oh. All right. <clears throat> what are these? Freezer. Refrigerator-y type places. The one thing in this game that I'm kind of scared of is I want to make sure that I like find the things. Is there something down there or am I just, yep, seeing things. Um, I want to make sure to like find the tarot cards if we can. And the problem is you never know what triggers the like next scene. Lodge renovation plans. Let's see. Um, blueprints for structural repairs on the lodge's chimney column. Judging by the scrawled annotations, this is not something Chris Hackett has the money to action right now. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, because the camp was established in 1953, so this place is pretty old. Um, but at least we know that the chimney needs repairs. I imagine that that'll come in handy. <clears throat> roof plan quote too high look for cheaper option next year okay I'm just trying to see if there's anything else they give you whenever you inspect an object they kind of give you like an introductory like glance and a brief explanation of what it is but you can always like go back and do a further inspection Ooh, what is all this mess put on the floor that's the back door. There's another window that we're walking by. Stuff on the table. I hate that the music is like boom, 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 boom. Okay, I kind of want to go in the cage. I don't really want to go out the back door just yet. Not sure why there's like a cage of stuff. I keep seeing like odd lighting and I think it's the something is on the shelf. Inspect it. Oh, can we unlock this? Okay. Yeah, see it looks like something's down there on like the bottom shelf, but I think that's just weird lighting. Doesn't look like there's anything else in here, just old chairs. See, I feel like it's gonna come in handy that we've unlocked that. Oh, that, nope, that's the spider box. All right, let's head for the back door. We're 100% nobody is gonna try and murder us. Staff only, okay, it's not like the actual back door. I wonder where this goes. Locked. Kick it down. Kick door. Mother Hubbard! Ah. Ah. I thought that was gonna be like a really powerful moment where she's like boom and like kicks her through the door. Apparently not. <laughs> oh no. Man, now she's probably gonna like have a limp and get like super murdered later. Oh no. Oh. Good golly, Miss Molly. 
Is it though? Well, that's like, f- like that. five watermelons and some snacks. I be pissed when you made us dash. What? No, no, he literally left you guys here. Strategy. Yeah. It's like, um, I agree with Jacob. Human rights or whatever. Sure. <laughs> Now let's see what we are working with. Hold that. The door will latch otherwise. Ooh. Oh. Hell yeah. What does he mean it'll latch? Like they're on the inside. It's not like it's gonna lock, right? Job done. What's that? Oh. Beer? I wanna look around. Go for it. Okay. So yeah, I guess it's probably just like Mr. Hackett's personal beer. Nothing. Anything over here? Jacob, old backpacks. Check this out. What? I can't move, or else the door will latch. They look like camping supplies. Yeah. Oh, okay. Um, there's tents back at the fire pit, so just. With like a tear on it. Let's go. Torn bags. Let's check it out. Torn hiking bags dash with flecks of dried blood. That's never good. Get a bear to this? Or something. <clears throat> so I'm gonna inspect them again real quick. Let me just see. There's like scissors, backpacks. Yeah, there's like slashes all over them. Creepy. Um ooh, is this a tarot card? No. Oh, ooh, is cool. that a gun? What? What is it? A gun? Yes. Oh, cool. And a oh, code. That must be for the safe. Okay. That's like the opposite of gun safety. No, 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 no. We're not done. Oh, okay. <laughs> Yeah, see, there's, like, odd lighting on whatever that is that's on the shelf. All right, let's check the freezer. Oh, I thought it was going to let us check the freezer, but apparently not. So just the camping bags and nothing else, and we got what we came for, and here we go. So you're, uh, you're really going to keep the gun, huh? Yeah. For bears. For bears. Okay. Uh, well, I am gonna find something to call this lot back to camp. If he spooks us with this clown mask, I'm gonna be super pissed off at him. Oh, nope, that's the map again. I thought it was something new. Nope, we're good. us with this mask. What was that creaking noise? We're gonna go through here. I don't think he's in here. Oh. Oh, okay, he's standing by the front door. Whew, everything's fine. in here i'm in hey very nice <laughs> i'm in oh okay shotgun shells is what that a is shotgun that she has uh, just some fireworks oh, oh. fireworks fireworks yeah but i don't think we should no 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 no, no. emma fireworks. oh also there's like an island in the middle of the lake and she did see yeah take the fireworks um you know you're right she did see something on fire earlier <laughs> Fireworks. Chosen. Oh, um, and might I just add, um, <clears throat> fireworks. <laughs> okay. Oh, no. I found these, like, torn up bags back there. They were pretty messed up, and I think they might have had blood on them. Oh, oh, stop. Stop. Stay right there. Uh, oh, dude. Peanut butter butter pops. Dude, peanut butter. <laughs> Fucking butter pops. Not gonna lie, they sound kind of good. 
I'm going to be affectionate. What are butter pops? No. What? I don't know what they are either. I can't believe it. Um, okay. Um. <clears throat> pop, pop, peanut butter, butter pops. <laughs> pop, pop, pop them in your mouth. Pop. Oh my god. They're Ugh. like the greatest snack. He seems so dumb, but so sweet. <laughs> are they like popcorn? What? No. No, 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 no. They're not In my mind, they're like Reese's Puffs. They're like their own thing. Like their own sub-genre of food snack. Well, now I'm intrigued as to what they ate. Taste like. Since I was a kid. You are in for such a treat. Okay, wait. Is there an expiration date yeah, on That was my next question. Uh, no, they're still good. Oh my god, they're like 20 years old. Yeah. Okay. Look, they predate expiration dates. Mm. Well, you're gonna love them. I am the same way about expiration dates. If you ask my husband, I will throw anything out past its expiration date. Out front. I'm trying to get better about it and not throw out everything. Uh, I'm sorry, what? Because food waste, but at the same time, like... Like, um, like treasure? Uh, uh, <laughs> no, before that. Wheelbarrow? Uh, yeah. Uh, okay. Uh, it's like, um, it's like a barrel with wheels. You can put stuff in it and just wheel it around. Oh, I see. <sighs> Ladies first. Yep. I feel like I missed part of that interaction. Something something wheelbarrow. So we know somebody was watching them outside. All right. The inner sanctum. So this is Mr. Hackett's this, office. This is where the magic happens. <clears throat> okay, yeah, let's just make this quick. Sure, just give me a sec to get this going. So last and time... Engage. Oh. Podcast. Charging. Yeah. All right. Uh, they seem like they kind of joke around a little bit with each other. Let me guess. Right now you're listening <laughs> to one that has eerie music fade-ins and a mysterious demeanor and a broken syllable raspy voice and a mysterious lonely guy in his mom's basement getting hard for Area 51 and Bigfoot. Mm. Sounds about right. I, I, sorry, not that you're into that stuff. I didn't mean to... I mean, whatever. I like it anyway. You know, I'd give it a listen. I mean, no, I don't care either way. No, Ryan, I'm gonna do this for you. What is the podcast called? Bizarre yet bona fide. You're trying not to laugh right now. <laughs> boner, aren't you? I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> Unbelievable. So Ryan last time was listening to a podcast yeah. about the Hag of Hackett's Quarry. In his private den of sin. Uh, I don't know, man. I feel a little weird going through his stuff. Okay, well, I don't. I mean, come on. What kind of dirty secrets is the owner of a summer camp full of impressionable young children going to have anyway? <laughs> Not Mr. H. I know. He's cool. Yeah. Cool to me. I was gonna say, so Brian and Mr. Hackett seem like they've kind of been buds. Oh, we're what's his name? Nick. Um last time Ryan came in here with Mr. Hackett and Ryan was asking him for kind of like life advice, like should I do this, should I do that? Um, those are our phones. And they're charging, so I'll leave them for a bit. Summer so camp time table. Those little drawings. Chris and Abby. Oh, Abby is Abigail. And then Chris, I don't remember. To do bleach toilets, set trap for raccoon, clean shotgun. Interesting. Um, so yeah, last time they were here, Ryan was like asking Mr. Hackett for advice and he overheard Mr. Hackett take a phone call. Hey, give me your number. I want to try it out. Why? We can ask you on a date. Uh, so that I can ask you out on a date. Mmm, uh, smooth. I think if I try a <laughs> cell phone number on this thing, it would just explode. Uh, hello? What? What? Is that his name, smooth. Dylan? Uh, or I thought it was Nick. Hello? I can't remember. I don't. It's weird. 
Oh, we're burping his something. name. Hmm. Maybe you should have asked them out on a date. <laughs> Damn it, I missed my shot. That was really creepy. Oh, is that one of those, like, singing bass things on the wall? I hope so. Um, so, yeah, but last time Ryan overheard uh, Mr. Hackett on the phone, like, yeah, I got to get these kids out of here. got to get them out of camp. Don't worry, they'll be gone by tonight. And he was really trying to push us out of here, but I'm not sure why. So, family photo. A younger-looking camp leader, Chris Hackett, with his two kids, Caleb and Kaylee. They look happy. They do. Kaylee and Caleb Hackett. His face looks so photoshopped on there, though. I like him. Yeah, me, I, me too. Um, they are pretty reclusive, you have to admit. I'm a monster without coffee. <laughs> I just really like the mug. All right, um, let's see what else is over here. Oh, that looks like a trap door. I'm so scared to like click on stuff just in hey, case it's like uh, gonna end the scene. Mr. H told me it was for um, bears. Bears here? Yeah, yeah. He said yeah. they don't really come around because he's got the gun. Yeah. It's fair. You could load like rubber buckshot in it or something to scare him away. But what if bears crash? Dude, we're gonna be out partying in the woods tonight, all right? What if the bears try to crash? Okay, it's it's like my mom always said: if you want to party, you gotta bring protection. <laughs> well, I think that she was talking about condoms. I'm not gonna fuck a bear. Reasonable stance. The most dangerous Can't argue thing with I've them. seen in these woods is a pissed off squirrel. That sounds pretty scary. It does sound scary, actually. Okay, fine. Well, we know where the gun is. It. Hopefully we don't. Oh, I would take that gun. Yo, leave the gun alone, man. You got it, boss. <sighs> Ryan is no fun. Ryan's gonna get us all killed. Alright, so there's a door. This is probably just talking to Ryan. Uh, I'm gonna check out our phones real quick. See how they're like doing. Speed it up at all? Yeah, let me just I speed up power. Him. Go for it. You guys can do it. It's not working. <laughs> <laughs> He's a great character. Are those deers? Are they dead deers? I can't really tell what that is. All right, so we've got the door, and we've got the trap door. I'm going for the trap door. Hello, what is this? <laughs> you hear that? I mean, they have to know that there's something underneath of where they are Such because it's like wood? an elevated lodge. Suspicious. Yeah, I guess it goes to the basement. Huh. But why would Mr. H have a secret trap door in his office that goes to the basement? Maybe he was here before this was his office. He's like a million years old. This has always been his office. <laughs> it's always for storage. Yeah, or so that he can make a quick getaway when the heat comes down. Uh, okay. Or it's for storage. Go ahead, open it up. His mouth, like, doesn't open when he talks. It does kind of sound like he's mumbling, too. All right, well, it looks like a pit of eternal darkness, so. Yeah, no, close it. Climb down, take a look. No, no, no. Please do that. don't climb down there. You opened it, you climbed so last time in the prologue, when Max and Laura climbed down there, oh yeah, we're climbing down. Um, when Max and Laura went down there, uh, oh, Max for sure was like attacked by something. There was a dog collar down here, but it was too big for a dog, and oh it had the God, name Ryan, Ian on it. Not believe this. What? What? It's nothing. Oh. I had you go in there for a second. I'm so upset that I no. actually came down here. This Maybe. was a terrible idea. Shut up. Oh no. Oh! It is, uh, it's my cat. <laughs> she just jumped up here and scared. 
the life out of yeah, me. Okay, Hi, Kitty. Out. Oh, no. Oh, sugar. So because we climbed down there, we loosened one of the rungs. Which means that somebody's probably going to try and climb that ladder later and not be able to make it out. Uh, playful. Ringy dingy ding. Oh, sorry, bud. Gotta take this <clears> one <throat> second. Hello, Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. What doesn't kill you will make you stronger. What can I do for you on this darn tootin' doozy of a day? Is that your impression of Mr. A? <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah, I, you're absolutely okay, right. Okay, his name must be Dylan. Mr. Dylan. And, uh, what's that? You want him to give Dylan his phone number? That's a little forward, but I can see what I can do. Move. I can't wait to play this game again after playing through it once, now that I like know the things that I know. A good oh. journal. Laura Kearney and Max Spring. Okay, those are the people from the prologue. Yeah, those are the ones that never showed up. Max yeah, for sure of these goobers died. That to work extra shifts this summer. And I think Laura's still alive. Ooh, counselor's ledger. Okay. A list of counselors' names, personal details, and their tasks at camp. Two names are crossed out. Laura Kearney and Max Brindley. Why didn't they show up? We know why they didn't show up. Oh, I'm so mad we climbed that ladder. All right. Let's see what's under the fish. Yo, my guy. How's my keys? Uh, so you can poke around in Chris's private area? Yes, exactly. I, I'm sorry, is that something that only you're allowed to do? <laughs> Hardy, har, har. Come on, what's the harm in looking? It's... You're not a little bit curious? I'm not gonna touch anything. Fine. Don't let me regret it. Can't promise Definitely that. Definitely not gonna touch anything. Oh, uh, oh, oh, got it. Nothing but that. <laughs> you're using that wrong. For some reason, I thought I was gonna have to catch it again. <laughs> huh. Oh, is this like his like actual personal living quarters? Fashion icon. Mr. H knows what he likes. I'm sure he does. Wow. There's... Yo. Hey, hey, maybe we shouldn't. But I didn't even get a chance to explore the other rooms. Uh, Brian? Is it like a dark room for like photos? Whoa, what the fuck? These monitors, this is the cam. Huh. Is Mr. H spying on us? No, no. I mean, no, no, it can't be. These are just, they're all different trails in the woods around camp. <laughs> sure. Most of the cameras are pointed away from camp, so it's not like he's spying on the kids unless they wandered out into the woods. You know, these are just, these yeah. are just trail cameras. What are trail cameras? People set them up to yeah. catch weird... Like wildlife shit. roaming by? I mean, that kind of like makes sense. Like, like bears in camp. Bigfoot stuff. Bigfoot stuff. You know, that kind of thing. <laughs> it's a bit of a stretch. Ooh, maybe he listens to that podcast. Yeah, Mr. H is into that kind of stuff. Shit, maybe he likes that podcast that you listen to. Great hobby, I guess. No. Expensive hobby. Yeah. Yeah, well, what else are we gonna do out here? Yeah, I guess camp probably does get pretty lonely when there's no one else around. Yeah. Okay, but why go through all the trouble? Of <laughs> I just got chills. Through a secret door in the closet. Hmm. Uh, I mean, not exactly. It's secret, super right? secret, it's just, and I want to explore the rest of this room. Well. Now. Yeah, that's what a secret is, Ryan. It, it, it's weird. weird. It's major league yeah, weird. I don't disagree with you, but it, it's it gotta be something juicy in here. Dylan, it's it's none of our business. And if you really want to know, you can ask him tomorrow. I'm sure that won't be an awkward conversation, like at all. Okay, yeah. There's no way we're surviving the night to actually ask that all question. Right. I I'm leaving this secret layer. Have fun. Hey, you just admitted that it's a secret, secret layer. layer.
And there's like a microphone. Oh, that one moved and it scared me. What was that? Ooh. Did that one just like go offline? It's probably nothing. It's probably nothing. It's fine. Yeah, there's like a microphone right there. Yeah, so that one's just like gone. I kind of want to see if like a second one goes down. That one over there doesn't work. Ooh, I didn't quite look up to the top Okay, ones. these are boring. I mean, if I saw one of them just like disappear. Wait, excavation site, scrapyard, the island. Wait, okay. So Hackett's house or Hackett house, excavation site, but that's not the same as the lodge. And I thought we were in the lodge right now, maybe not. And it goes down to the boathouse, over to the island, woodwalk, cabins, scrapyard. Oh, camera locations. Okay, so I wonder which one just went down. Uh, the scrapyard. Clean all the lodge camera lenses. Oh, there's lots of cameras. Like, lots of them. Reposition front right camera. Trim back leaves and branch around the woodwalk ones. Boathouse. Check faulty back left camera. Zipline landing. Fire pit. Oh, this place looks like fun. Big canyon. Oh, shotgun shell offers 20% off. Hmm. I hope it's not important that we have to know that. Oh, that's just that again. Okay, here we go. Is that it? All right, guess so. Woo! So uh, yeah, spinning around there. Oh, door is this way. For some reason, I was seeing the door ahead as like the door to open. I didn't even get to explore any of the other rooms. Oh, thank goodness. Okay. 28 and 32. I wonder if I have, like, a limited amount of time. Sounds like a guitar. Can't, like, explore anything else. Okay, let's just see if we can check out the other room real quick. Ooh. These controls are a little difficult. Well, there's some pretty heavy duty stuff in here. Yeah, maybe oh. let's not touch that. Like ibuprofen yeah, and Tylenol. Take a look again. Okay, painkiller of some kind, ibuprofen. Heart medicine. Sleeping tablets for great white teeth. That's very cute. And then the paracetamol is just Tylenol. Something, something, take before sleep. Doesn't seem exciting aside from the sleeping medication. Okay, okay, cool. Glad we did that. All right. Nice. Up. Um, I don't think there's anything else to explore. I think we saw everything. Yeah, so, all right, cool. Let's go. I mean, oh, I wonder if though if I could have like kept exploring and then the phones could have charged up longer. I guess we'll find out. It's hard for me to believe that there's not like another single outlet or somewhere to charge anything except for in his office only. This would be a lot easier with Mr. H's chainsaw. It's really very pretty out here when there's no kids around. So that's Abby and I can't remember the guy's name. We really haven't talked to him much. No. You've seen my class? She seems Just to be into like art and stuff like that. 
Well, she was, I think, drawing in chapter one. Yeah, well, there's this shortcut that I took. Of it. Which way should we go? <laughs> and she definitely has a crush on him, and it maybe kind of seems like he likes her. Let's go to Shady Glade. That seems way better than Rocky like. Road. <laughs> oh, that just makes me want ice cream. <laughs> Oh. oh my god, are you okay? I'll be okay. <laughs> okay. Come on, I'll spot you. I still keep thinking, like, scary stuff has got to be coming soon. Well, this doesn't seem like the smartest of ideas, but okay. Oh, his head. Look at his head. How do you turn your head that far? That doesn't quite seem right. Uh, if I pause... Okay, this is Nick. I thought there was somebody named Nick, and then I was like, maybe I'm just thinking of that Dylan guy. Well, there's two ways to go here. Or you can just, like, wander through the woods. This looks like it just kind of, like, loops around here. See, like, but what if something's in the grass over here? Because it was something super, like, I don't know. Me missing the, like, tarot card for the very first thing. It, it, I, like, barely missed it. Oh, you can just walk all through the woods. You don't actually have to walk on any paths or anything. Um, okay. Ah, aha, aha! Oh, that's one of the trail cameras. Wait, how do I... Where's the... Oh, you can, like, hear it doing its thing. There. I was like, where's the, like, trigger for the... Is that a camera? Yeah. Maybe it's for the wildlife? Yeah. Trail camera hidden in the trees. Security measure, perhaps? Or maybe they're tracking something. Oh, I hate that it's making, like, zooming, focusing noises. I sure hope I wasn't supposed to remember where those uh, cameras are. Sorry, Abby, I'm just kind of wandering around. So, um, I heard this joke about artists. It's pretty bad. I want to hear it. Oh, yeah. yeah. You want to hear it? Yes. Sure. Okay. Here it is. Why couldn't the world's fastest painter ever keep a girlfriend? Mm, why not? Because he always finished in one stroke. <laughs> it's dumb. Sorry, Jacob told me that. It does sound like a Jacob joke. <laughs> Oh. about golfers because of the stroke thing Ooh. yeah sorry I don't know <laughs> Jacob probably heard it from his campers that makes so much sense those kids have filthy minds Uh, ooh, let's reassure her. Hey, don't worry about it. It's just the forest playing tricks on you. I used to go camping all the time with my dad, and I think you hear and see some pretty weird stuff, but you just realize it's nature doing its thing. Did you just say thing? No, that's the forest up to its old tricks again. <laughs> I've never been camping. It's pretty nice if you open yourself up to it. So you have to be open-minded to enjoy camping? No, I just mean there's a lot of stuff you have to overlook. Like basic comfort. Mm. You really just have to try it. Like a 
take you oh. some time. Oh, you could say keep camping some time. Um, maybe. Let's just make it through tonight, please. Yeah. Yeah. Everything's gonna go so well. Wait, where are we now? Because I think I was, like, trying to head this way. When he started telling his dumb joke. See those, like, paths and stuff? I was trying to see if there's like caves or anything over here. Oh, it's all dark and spooky. Oh, there's a fence. Oh. Well, that's really nice. Like waterfall area into a river. That's cute. All right. Back to the trail, I guess. Is there like a way? Sorry, I'm like pushing some buttons to see if there's a way to like walk faster. What's this thing? Ranger Hi. box. Oh, sorry. Uh, box in the woods. Unlocked. Inside is a change of clothes, bottled water, and supplies. Provisions for a ranger, perhaps? Do these woods even have a ranger? I think it's a ranger box. Oh. Like a supply cache for rangers or whatever if they're out in the woods. Seems kind of weird because... Oh. So it would seem. <laughs> it seems kind of weird because they are like not far from camp. Like where... Where would a ranger be? Where was I even going? This way? Oh, this is so like sweet and romantic and right before Keep everybody gets killed. Popular. Oh, I know where we are. Yeah? Up here. Up here, we'll be safe. Sure. It's really pretty though. I'm just gonna sketch it real quick. Go sit beside her or something. I'll be sincere. Damn, Abby, you're really good. No, no, this is nothing. <laughs> no, really, I'm not just saying that. This is rough. But if I can get a little bit of it down, then I'll remember it better later. It's really cool you know that about yourself. Um, yeah. I guess so. I mean, not everyone knows what they're capable of, you know? I'm sure you're capable of a lot, Nick. <laughs> I mean, of course. I just... I don't know what. You'll figure it out. It's gonna get dark soon. And they're gonna be in the woods in the dark. Did you hear that? No. Oh. Oh. Oh, listen, there's something there. <laughs> like a wild pig. Oh, it's so cute. It looks like a javelina. Uh -uh, uh -uh, uh -uh. Oh my god, he's so Excuse me. Yeah, I was like there should be like a mama pig somewhere though. Uh save Abby. <laughs> Tutorial time. Don't breathe. 
You need to stop breathing. Tricking the beast into taking you for nothing but a corpse. And where's the fun in hunting them which is already dead? Watch the visuals alter or listen to the sound change as the threat approaches. When the danger has passed, run. Pick the right moment and run for your life. Be warned. Exhaling or running at the wrong time may just mark you as the creature oh. causing serious consequences. Okay. Oh, we have a meter on the side. Should have kept holding it. I couldn't tell. I thought they like walked away. Okay. Good news, it's fine. Nobody got gored to death. Oh no. I feel like that could have been actually really bad. Uh. Playful. Okay. Did you get all that? <laughs> huh? I thought you were gonna draw me getting French by a wild pig. <laughs> Got it all up here. <laughs> Every time they teach me a new skill, I get like more nervous. Yeah, y'all need to go back to camp while it's still light out. Wait, how did she put that notebook in that tiny backpack? There's no way. I guess we should head back. It's like a magic backpack. Hmm. Real quick, I'm just gonna pause it. Um, actually, settings. I just wanna go to display or graphics. There we go. I'm gonna try turning VSync on. Because I'm noticing a little bit of screen tearing, and I'm hoping that is still okay on the stream. Looks okay. I finally get my phone back, and it's just a big dumb brick. <clears throat> Why didn't Ryan and Dylan just take everybody's phones to get charged? And it looks like nothing is on fire out there. Oh, right stick. I'm so scared something is gonna jump out at us. Oh, that's the zip line over there. Let's take a picture. It's kinda... Yeah. Not a photographer by any means. Hey, Caitlin. Guess what? Mr. H. Hey, Dylan. What's up? He has hidden cameras everywhere and a secret room. <laughs> no, that's not. <laughs> Whoa, now. Back up. What? His eyes are everywhere. He's always watching us. Look it off, man. He, he's just got trail cameras. So like, you know, forest surveillance, that kind of thing. Mm. Oh, you don't think that's weird? No. Well, he's got a perimeter to check. Kids to protect. Yeah. Probably just to keep track of wildlife. You guys have no imagination. So, uh, what's going on here? Everything ready? Bro, how's tree there? Oh, was there a weird light inside the treehouse? Didn't even notice. Ah, uh, yeah. Sue! So, are you pretty boring? I wonder, uh, maybe a satellite fell out of the sky or something? Yeah, <laughs> and landed in the forest, waking from her slumber, the hag, uh, hack it. Okay. You know, I just realized we may never see each other again after tonight. This you is true. I just realized that. Just trying to set the mood. What mood? The mood, the vibe, you know. Must be party of vibe. Setting the mood. I and I think to. Caitlin has a crush on Plus, Ryan, if I remember correctly. I mean, I guess they do, but. Mm -hmm. All right, right guy. Time to get wood. Yes. Mm -hmm. 
wording. Oh, I know what I said. Firewood. Abby, Nick, just in time. <laughs> you got wood. <laughs> you got wood. <laughs> yes, my sleep just came home. Oh, that's all we need. There's already a big pile of logs here. Sweet. We could have gotten more, but there was a hog or a boar. But Nick was very, very brave and took one for the team. <laughs> oh my gosh, it can't be. It's the hog of Hackett's quarry? What? <laughs> Thought you hated that phrase. Big jokes take big sacrifices. Go She's brave. not wrong. Oh, I just want to shrink you down to little pocket people and put you in my pocket and peep at you when I need a little pick me up. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Agreed, that was weird. I like how they're just like wow. holding <laughs> wood. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Where the hell did that gun come uh, from? Dude, relax, okay? It's not even real. Uh well, I mean it's a real gun, but it's just for shooting bears. I found it in the storage room. <laughs> okay, fine, fine, we'll put it down. Thank you. Guns are no joke, dipshit. Agreed. And, and, we bring you a hand-picked selection of only the <laughs> finest that Hackett's Quarry has to offer. No freaking way. Yes, freaking way. Peanut butter pop, butter. Pop, peanut butter butter puffs. <laughs> pop, pop, pop them in your mouth. Pop. I didn't even know you could still find these in here. Hey, they're so cute. Just there, cowboy. All right, these are spoken for. Dude, you can't just shove those in my face and not expect me to want to pop, pop, pop them in my mouth. Come on, Emma. Please hand me the shotgun. Who? What, you're gonna shoot me over them? No, dumbass. Okay, we are going to shoot for them. Nah, dude. Absolutely not. No. Agreed. No. Save the ammo. Stern. Okay, there is no way I'm leaving these dillweeds alone with a gun. Come on. Look, the shooting range is like right over there. Mm -hmm. Okay, it'll be fun. Okay, look. You and me. Old fashioned shootout. First prize. Peanut butter butter pops, all to yourself. Dude, what if I we just share a room? Then, huh? No, don't do it. Don't waste Fun the gun. ammo. Yeah, boy. Jacob, hand me that gun now. And nobody's handling any firearms that's gonna act like a dick about okay, it. Okay, then you can be the ref. We need an objective third party. Okay, we're trying to get a party started here, Jacob. Okay, well, Is she loading it? Die just because you're off on a little side quest. Come on. It looked like she was loading the shotgun. All right. I guess we're going to have ourselves an old-fashioned shootout. Yeah. Look, there's a clearing we can use as a shooting range back there, but if I see either of you dicking around, I am turning this car around. Oh, uh. we'll be good. <laughs> was she, like, the shooting instructor in camp? Okay, so... <sighs> Just so you know, I was an expert marksman, <clears throat> third class, three years in a row, ranked highest in camp each year. I'm just letting you know that your goose is cooked, Nick, but if you back down now, I might let you just have one little peanut butter butter pop if you're lucky. Man, no, no, I want a peanut butter butter pop. Shoot. Yeah, that's because you've never shot before. Yeah, not that you know of. <laughs> okay, I think I would know if okay, you're actually- Okay, boys, I'm gonna have to stop you right there. As much as I'm enjoying your charming machismo, the moment we step foot on the shooting range, we're playing by my rules, okay? And what I say goes, got it? Okay, good. Now I'm gonna go set up some targets and get more shells. Do not move a muscle or touch his gun until I'm back. Do not touch the gun when someone right, is downrange. Kind of no I'm always hot, pencil. Yeah, down. okay, thank <laughs> you. Bye. Bye. So, um, Jesus. how was your little one on one with Abby in the woods? It was good. Uh, yeah. Be open a minute. It was, it was okay. Hey, <laughs> boy. So, I mean, what happened? Well, it's we ours. A little. She's oh, oh. really smart. Yeah. Mm, yeah. Got chased by a pig. I mean, you see the deal? Don't be gross. No, 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 no. Hey, look, no sweat. Okay. We all get performance anxiety sometimes. You just better make your move before a real man swoops in. Like that. Giant guy who's covered Speaking in blood. Of, let me show you how a real man shoots his gun. <coughs> Are you guys seriously still thumping your chests at each other? No, I think he's got brain damage. Okay, please just give me the gun. Uh-uh. You'll have it when I say you'll have it. 
All right, huddle up, boys. This is how we're gonna do this. You're shooting the one on the left. Nick first, then Jacob's turn. The Keep your fingers bottle on the left. The trigger till you're ready to shoot. You got it? Aye, aye. All right. Two things. Remember the spread. Remember the recoil. This is a shotgun. We're not sharpshooting here. The flashlight shows you where you're aiming. Tutorial not. I think this is one I want to know. I'm sorry to have to say, there may well be times during your stay at Hackett's Quarry where you'll have to defend yourself using potentially deadly force. When engaging in combat, simply aim your weapon and shoot where the flashlight is pointed. Take note, if you're up close and personal with your target, you'll do more damage. The farther away, the larger the spread and injuries may not be fatal. There's a time and place for the use of weapons, and you may want to consider all your options. Remember, it's not always wise to pull the trigger. That's how people get hurt. Okay, so Right, we're, oh, we're aiming for the shotgun, or the, the shotgun, the watermelon on the left. Okay, um, fire. All right, Nick, one point. Okay, we're too far back to do any yeah. real damage. Let's scooch forward a little and uh, fuck these guys up. Look at this. All right, Nick, this time for real. I'm aiming for the watermelons, right? She said the one on the left. What does that mean? The bottle on the left? The watermelon on the left? Yeah. Nice shot. Uh, for that bottle. To you, Nick. Good job, Nick. I got three points. Hey. Let's see what you got. All right. You might want to uh, avert your eyes, Nick. <coughs> I don't want to give you any more performance anxiety. Oh, for a second, I thought he was going to, like, shoot it from the hip. I thought you were an ultra elite pro marksman. Yeah, with like a rifle. Okay, now with this freaking cannon doing? blaster. That is how you get someone shot. Yeah. Nah, it's okay. You probably would have missed me anyway. Who? <laughs> hey, disqualified for being a dumbass. No. Fair. Oh. Butter pops in. Ooh, what's that shaky, huh? Huh? Pop, pop. Peanut butter, butter okay, pops. I get it. I get it. Jacob doesn't like losing. Liam, you thought this was over? Ooh! Yes. Girl, get it. Get those peanut butter butter pops. Peanut butter butter pops. All right, I'm going to go ahead and pause it right here for a few minutes. Go ahead and take a quick break uh, before we get into it. Just from that really quick scene, it looked like it was maybe getting to be nighttime, and I'm worried that that's when all the action is going to happen. So I'm going to take a quick break, go get myself some water. I suggest you all do the same. Stay hydrated, and I'll see you in a few minutes. All right. There we go. Camera's back up and running, and we are ready to get back to it. All right. Yeah, see, now it's like nighttime. Now is when the spooky, scary stuff starts happening, I think. The 
this makes me want to go camping. Okay. New idea. Oh, right. Okay. This chapter was called Truth or Dare, I believe. Uh, Come on, people. We might never see each other after tonight. Let's make True. some memories. Well, what do you have in mind? How about the ultimate game of secrets and lies? Truth Dylan or Dare. Dylan style. But Dylan style. <laughs> okay. House rules are someone asks you truth or dare, then you choose, and then you do. And there's no ifs, ands, or buts. So, like, normal truth or dare? Dylan style. Yes. <laughs> so we can, like, make people kiss? Ooh, if they girl, do dare. it. Yeah. As long as everyone consents, of course. Okay, that's fair. That means. I mean, keep it in your pants until it's your turn. But... <laughs> Who does get to go first? Well, it's house deals, so... Abigail. Mm. Truth or dare? Um... Oh, from the pause screen, I think we were playing we really before, as huh? Ryan. All right, here goes. Have you ever slept with anyone? Oh, I, I, like ever? I. Mm, nah, I'm gonna let this one play out. Have you ever slept with anyone at this camp? Okay, there we go. <laughs> no. Mm. Nope. Sorry. All right, Abby, it's your turn. <laughs> oh, that was cute. All right. Okay. Um. Uh, Abby, oh my God, just pick someone. Okay. Okay. Um. I don't know. Oh, ding, ding, ding. Too late. My turn. <laughs> Ryan. Truth or dare? <gasps> dare. <laughs> dare. Give me what you got. Okay, Ryan. Your dare mm. comes with a choice. Yes, you do that? I can do whatever I want. <laughs> and I dare you to kiss either Caitlin or Dylan. Wow. I mean, I guess both is off the table. Sorry. Do we get to make this decision? You literally did, but okay. Let's do this. Uh, oh no. <laughs> okay. So I really want him and Caitlyn to get together, but like, is that too serious of a thing? But what if they die and he never gets to kiss her? Kiss Caitlyn. <laughs> Caitlyn? Oh. Do it, girl. At the same time, do you want your first kiss oh, to be a truth please. or dare kiss? I don't know. Oh, I should have made him kiss. But at least she knows maybe like he All likes her. Righty. Oh, Dylan is disappointed. See, I feel like if I'd kissed Dylan, then Caitlin would have been disappointed. So I'm not sure that there was a win-win. Wait, what was that? Uh, Jacob, you're next. All right, <clears> Jacob, <throat> let's see what you're made of. Oh, there. There, man, come on. <laughs> okay. I dare you to take a flying leap over that fire pit. Naked. <gasps> oh, dude! Fuck yes! You know, oh, but I then, like, you I'm trip, scared. and that's how your, See, like, yeah, genitals get burnt or something, right? Like, oh. No, Jacob. Wait. Don't do it. Stop. Get a girl. Dude, I say veto. You're gonna fuck yourself up. Yeah. <laughs> what? Come on, man, I got this. Ryan, come on. No. You know what? Fuck this game. All right. <clears throat> Someone else can go. Okay, fine. Then I call your turn. Okay. Uh, whatever. Oh. Jacob just wanted to have fun. Emma. There. Emma, so you have to kiss. Why is always kissing people? Jacob? Or... Nick. Uh. <laughs> well then. Um. Uh, sorry, Nick. This is not uh, there, obviously. I don't know if that's a good idea. I Emma. Nick. Oh, Emma, don't do it. Seriously? She knows that Abby likes him. Yeah. What the heck? Seriously? Guys, 
Oh no. Bad feelings all around. Why are his eyes open? He's angry. Thank you, Nick. Ooh, Jacob's getting really angry. He's good. Yeah, I would walk away from her, too. It's kind of a crappy thing to do when you know she like likes him. Was just a hey, I am nobody's girlfriend. The fuck it was. You just a game. Yeah, the fuck it was, man. Mm hmm. Jacob, grow up. <sighs> well, I guess I should probably. I think this is how all Truth or Dare games play out. You should probably go find Abby. So, anybody want to play Bargeezy? Bargeezy. What? What's that? <gasps> oh, oh, oh! Are these the two dudes? Wait, like what? His head looked weird. <gasps> oh. Okay. I feel like those are the same two people from earlier. Ooh. Did I not find a tarot card again? I am How? What did I miss? Delighted that you're here. So then, nothing. Nothing has been found. found. It was probably. I wonder if it was on like Rocky yeah, Road instead of the Shady Grove or whatever. Heard, do you think? I don't know why I returned. I can't help you without the cards. I want them found. I want them returned to me. Please. I agree with you. I want hints. That's all I have to say for now. Secrets remain mm. buried and the night grows darker. I'll see you again. You can count on that. Be see careful. you again. Where the wolves go, the ravens follow. Hmm. Oops. Does that mean we're on to chapter three? Okay, okay. I was so careful too. Like I said, I cannot wait to play this game again and be able to like explore the things I did not find the first time. Stupid game. What am I in middle school? Why should I even care? Why do I think it's anybody stupid? Stupid. No, you should care because Emma's a crappy friend. What the hell am I? Not even tree and color. Friend. Ooh, girl, you're lost alone in the woods. Um, if you turn directly around and head back that way. Oh, I don't know how... I was like, I don't know how much y'all can hear about it being, like, creaking. Okay, I feel like it wanted me to go the other way, so I'm gonna go the other way. Whether or not that's a good choice. I literally cannot see hardly anything. And I did have the brightness turned up. I'm looking at it over on the capture. Um, I turned the brightness up, I think, a little more than it recommended. Um, just because I know sometimes things can come across dark on stream. And so I wanted it. Oh, I do know where we are, though. Okay. I actually do know where we are. And I'm pretty sure we went that way. Interesting. I wonder if we had gone on the rocky road path, if it would have put us in that area. Like, here's a place that you went previously. Abby, I like you. Don't get murdered, please. Yeah. Because we went down this way. This is the overlook. Oh. Yes, call back. Nick! Abby? 
out again. I'm over here. Nick. Hey. Oh, this game is so like I'm sure it gets so much scarier than this, but I feel so dead. Okay, we're here. We're back at the bench that we were at earlier. See? We can talk about our feelings. I love her red hair. It's so pretty. Let's be honest. You like him. I think that game just got a little too intense for me. Just be honest with each other. But she would probably be cautious. So, all that stuff back there? Oh my gosh. I don't really want to make Jacob jealous, huh? You think? I mean, yeah. the heck else would she kiss me like that? I was saying, I don't think it's because she actually likes him. Playing along. Oh, were you? Yeah. It's just a game, right? No, I don't feel like this is the moment for that. That'd be weird. I don't like, think Emma was the mastermind. After here. you just like make out with a guy, well, or make out with another girl and Caitlin. kiss another girl, and then oh, I guess that's <clears throat> mostly Caitlyn. She's sneaky. She's... <laughs> Truth of it, it's a stupid game, right? I'm trying to think of how many times I've like seen her been a part of Truth or Dare. I don't know how many times it's ever turned out well. Um apologetic. I don't know. Maybe it lets us act how we really feel. Mm. Or yeah. it lets us act as props to help Jacob and Emma hash out whatever bullshit they've got going on. Mm-hmm. So have feelings for her? No, I mean, I just meant the whole thing. Do you remember the second or third day of camp when we were assigned to take our cabins down to the island ropes course together? Yeah, that was when we met. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. do you remember that camper? The Looks like there's like green veins coming in from the side of the screen. Do you see that? you, I guess. Thanks for not telling anyone. Mm -hmm. That wasn't actually the first time we met. We met at orientation on the first day. We did? <laughs> there was like a million people. Um, but honestly, you kind of seemed like a dick. I said hi and you barely acknowledged me. I guess there would be other Sorry. staff rather than like camp counselors or whatever. Ooh, this is so creepy. Tease them a little. Jacob does it. Emma kind of does it too. Here we go. Oh. I've had my moments. I'm not proud of some of the stuff I've done. Let's be understanding. Everyone has their moments. But a moment like that day at the ropes course. Right before we get murdered by Hi. the animal in the woods. I knew I liked it. Ooh. See, now you guys kiss. Now's the moment. I didn't realize that. Oh. At the time. I'm not the best at it. Now you kiss. Emotions. She's like, I knew I wanted to kiss you, and you just lean in. Like, mm. I'm glad you told me. <laughs> so. So I'm saying that. I like you too. Whatever. <laughs> now kiss. <laughs> nope, just nope. Go right back to the campground. Good. Go. Run. It's like running through the woods or something.
I feel like I have some, like, <sighs> take some deep breaths. Oh, the tension's not over. I thought it was over. Sounds like a lion. Is that a bear? It's too fast. It's too fast? Bears are pretty fast. Although it probably would be louder if it were a bear. I really don't know. Is it the dog boy? What is that? What was that? No, did he just leave her? Oh, what is that thing? Uh, help, Nick. Nick. Oh my God. Is it just lurking up there? Oh no, she's gonna die too, isn't she? But something shot it, right? Okay, or somebody shot it. What was that? Was that the same thing? Oh, did she just... Run, 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 run. Uh, oh. Uh, run. Although they did say it was quick, maybe I should have hidden, but just run. Ah, ah, ah! What is this? A. I'm tapping A. I'm tapping. I'm tapping so fast. Whew. Okay. I feel like maybe the prompt for that was not as good as it could have been. No, don't climb a tree. That's so dumb. She does not seem super athletic. Keep running. Okay, so some kind of monster thing is out here in the woods attacking people. Oh. Is this the don't breathe part? Okay, so there's that thing. I hate this. And there's something hunting it. So maybe that's what they meant when they said it's hunting season. But does it only happen when it's like the full moon? Go, 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 go. I hope I did that right. Oh, I tried. Oh, girl, I tried. <sighs> okay. Is it fun again? Is he crying? Yeah, like, is it, like, the full moon and, like, maybe for, like, not the summertime, like, there are monsters out during this one time of year and then people come around to hunt them and maybe the hunters are, like, the good people here? Was that a scream we just heard? I mean, he shouldn't have gotten so mad, but at the same time, like, teenagers, young adults, emotions, etc. I guess they're not teenagers, probably. Just young adults. I don't know. <clears throat> oh! Wipe your tears away. Horse. Or not, actually. Little feelings are Jacob, hurt. I thought we agreed that this. But he likes you, likes you. It's just supposed to be some summer fun. Yeah, no, no. For a second, I thought that storm was like outside here. <laughs> you just love having an arm like that. 
Yeah. I mean, you just, I can't believe you, you fucking Frenched him. You know, in front of everyone. Jesus wept. Friends, are we 12? No, but Nick is. Oh. Kind of. <laughs> you know, I love the guy, but I don't think he's actually ever seen a girl naked before. Well, I hate to break it to you, but he just had his tongue down my throat, and he definitely knew what to do with it. Mm. You, you really love fucking with me, huh? Oh. Quite not, sir. Oh. You know what? Nothing. No. Nothing. Never mind. This is not how tonight was supposed to go. Fine. So he sabotaged he their van that they were supposed to like Don't drive out so in. Crazy imagining Nick's tongue in my mouth. Oh, come on. Or you can go grab us some towels. I do not care for what Emma. Towels for? It was well, funny to bring her. We mm -hmm. agree. Summer fun, right? Apparently, summer is not quite. Oh. Okay. I don't care for her. She seems super manipulative. Oh, I'm trying not to be super judgy, but I don't really like it when people mess with people. We just found some dead person. Who? Ah, what? Is that somebody like tied to the bottom of the lake? Or. Wait, what has he got in his hand? No, what did he have? Oh, I hate this. Wait, what? Oh, the star. Tarot found! We found it this time! Oh, it's the star. Stars in the night sky, beacons of light, dreams of hope, purpose, or a reminder of our insignificant uh, insignificance, fear of despair. Trust in the light of the star, with it comes clarity and sometimes proof. Okay, well, at least we found one. What's this? No swimming without supervision. Handmade sign warning people off swimming near the boathouse. How dangerous can the lake be? There's dead people tied to the bottom of it. Yeah, we'll it's fine. I mean, I imagine if it's because it's near the boathouse, then it's because you don't want to accidentally like run over people with the boat. They're in the water. Or maybe it's because there are creepy dead people in there. What's that? What's that? What's that down there? What is that? Oh. It's like bright red. It looks like it could be important. But it doesn't have like a light shining on it or anything. Okay. I guess we're just supposed to like go up top. Ooh. I don't want to head over to the canoes. I don't want to head over in the dark. Because I feel like we're all about to die. So, uh, okay. I'm still, like, not quite processing what happened to Abby and Nick. Um, are, are they dead? Because it kind of looks like he did not fare very well. She definitely got chomped in the neck. But, like, oh, no tells. Um... She definitely got chomped in the neck, but maybe exactly she survived? Did she get away? She ran away. But what if I find something else interesting, like this book? Dates. Okay. One on March 12th, 2016, two on September 24th, 2017, three was November 3rd, five on January 29th, manageable but unsustainable. Um, sailing rules, reminder for counselors, keep all boats rinsed after use, be vigilant, no swimming. Properly store boats to avoid damage, all campers must wear life jackets, if boats capsize, remove kids immediately. Do not jump in after them, sail over, and retrieve from water. 
So they don't want anyone in the lake at any point in time. And we're about to go swimming. Where is she? Nope, not that dark. No swimming without supervision. Oh, hell. oh, oh, oh my, oh my, oh my. She has less clothes on. Nothing over there. Oh, this is across the lake, right? Had the boathouse and stuff over there. Yeah, it looked like there's something moving over there. Like a light on. Whoa. Someone up there? Yeah, I'm gonna go with probably everything's fine. I can't tell if the island would be like a safe place to be or not. Um, it kind of seems like it maybe could be. What's all this? Boating stuff, probably. Looks like nautical flags um see i feel like there's probably like secrets over there by the canoes or something or is that what is that i don't really want to check it out it looks like a flower okay yeah nope turn around turn go back nothing of interest over here Okay, let's just uh, go swimming. I don't want to go swimming. I don't want to do this. The game is not giving me a choice, but I don't really want to do this. Drip dry, or you know, we could shake it up doggy style. Well, you really know how to talk to a girl, don't you? <laughs> Look, you can't just pretend that it didn't happen. Well, there's a dead person in there. Oh, but I can because you see, no. it all helps. He got out of his clothes very quick. <laughs> Not at all insecure man to come save me. <laughs> yeah, in a second she's really gonna be drowning. Ooh. Nope. Let it go, Jacob. Okay. What's I just this? a female in need of fear not fragile things for cute. Hurricane Jake is here. Hurricane Jackie Jake? Ball. For some reason that was her hand in the water and I for sure thought it was like a dead body hand. Oh, This is fine. I feel like nothing scary is about to happen just when it seems all peaceful and nice. Oh, okay. Okay, now you're gonna get it. See? Yeah, splasher. <laughs> This is kind of cute. No, no. There's a dead body in there. You really shouldn't actually be swimming in Dead Body Lake. Oh. oh I hate this. 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 <laughs> Dick move. Eh, flirt with her. She does not seem that serious. Check this out. Don't be sentimental. I don't think she's a sentimental kind of person. Okay. That was impressive. Take a picture of me. Uh, uh, yeah, for your like um little subscribers or whatever, top ten guys who will keep you satisfied at summer camp. Dead booty dough. Oh, so I get nine more? <laughs> what? That was Abby, I think, because the text was pink. Oh, shit. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <gasps> oh, gotta be fucking kidding me. 
Uh, dive in. That's our way out. Go get it before it sinks down to the bottom. Sorry, Abby. Jacob? Ugh, dick. Oh! I never know if I did the right thing or not! Uh, uh. Ooh. Are those like the flaky- <gasps> Oh. Oh no, is he like bleeding now? There it is, there it is. Get it, get it, get it, get it. Ooh, there's like flakes in the water and it's like skin flakes. It's like dead people skin flakes. Grab it. Oh, it's the dead person is in front of us. Oh. Okay. Okay. That's fine. That thing's not gonna move. <gasps> Okay, load of corpse. Upload a decomposing corpse chain to the bottom of the lake. Wait, how did he get stuck in another one? Detangle, stay calm. Stay calm. There is no need to panic. Wait, where's Emma? Shit. Okay. Not sure how much we could have done to save Abby anyway. And at least we have the rotor arm still so we can get out of here when it counts. Mighty fine social disruption there, Kaylin, I have to say. Ah, was it just the nudge that Abby needed? <clears throat> uh, no, because Good she's probably genius. dying in the woods. Who do you think is going to make the first move? Nick or Abby? Ooh, good cue. My bet's on either. Mm -hmm. I don't know, Nick's got the beast in him. Uh, if by beast you mean some sort of mild-mannered baby deer. Hey, don't let the cute preppy aesthetic fool you. It's like a steel barbecue grill under that shirt. <laughs> Dim abs, though. So, you noticed that, too, huh? Oh, oh. So, what do you guys want to do now? We can keep playing. Ooh. Yeah? Ooh. Just the three of us? Alright, Dylan. Truth or... Uh, oh, so, yeah, shit. Dude. Yep. Oh, my gosh. Uh, we gotta help him. <laughs> Wait, where did it come from? Get that going. Wait. Good girl. Oh, Dylan, you scaredy pants. Abby! Help! Please! Nick! Help him! Uh, nope. Uh, what happened? Hey! What happened? Abby, what happened? Yeah. Ryan. We gotta know what. Well, she needs help. Give her a second. No, 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 no. We need to find out so we can go. Go after Nick! Caitlin wants you to calm down. Okay, assertive. I got this. Okay. Believe in yourself, uh, Ryan. That shotgun's got a hell of a spread. Be careful. I feel like we're gonna accidentally end up like shooting Nick if we're not careful. It's got a okay. big spread. Okay. Go get her cleaned up. Mm -hmm. Uh, take shortcut. I pushed up, I pushed up, I pushed up. I feel like, I can't tell if it's me or my controller, but it did that, like, during the prologue, there was one, like, oh no. There was one moment like that. Okay. Eh, where, like, I definitely pushed up and it was, like, left, and I was like, no. I mean, I need to, like, bring my controller out. 
I was hoping if we took the shortcut, we'd get to him faster and potentially, like, save him. Uh, again, take shortcut. But we're gonna be better about our QTEs this time. Oh. See? Got it that time. Left. Okay. Left again. Okay. Good. Go, 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 Nick. Or Ryan. Oh. Okay, we didn't trip on the stairs. Right. We're doing good. I'm so nervous. Okay. <gasps> okay. See, this is the big guy who is like covered in blood. Don't shoot. Nope. Oh, shout? Shout. Hey! Get the fuck off of him! Stop, stop! Don't shoot though. We are not shooting. He's probably like holding. No. Maybe we can look around, but I think he's like holding pressure on his jugular to keep him from dying. No. Why did he shoot his own finger? I do not understand what just happened. Got again, we got a guy. Yeah, yeah. Come on, got a guy. Come on, let's get back to the fire. Okay, so whatever that guy was, unless he's like a shape changer, I don't think he was the monster. He looked nothing like the creepy things that were walking around in the woods. Mm. Okay. Stupid. 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 <laughs> so wait, where is he now? Just running around in the woods in his underwear? Oh, I think bleeding from both hands or something. What's happening? We go waiting for you back there, Jacob. What are you doing? Agreed. Oh, it's the piggy. <laughs> okay. That sounded like more than the piggy. It's like the monster hunting the piggy. Oh, please don't put me in control. No, do not call out. Just run. Whatever that is, I don't think it's any of our friends. Hello? Literally just- <gasps> Okay. Alright. Okay, here we go. And... Big crunch. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay. Okay. I really don't think this guy is like the bad guy. I might be a thousand percent wrong right now. Uh will just be nice. Oh, please, please, man, just, just let yeah. me down, okay? Just don't hurt me. I don't want to like threaten big guy with guns who just shot off his own finger. Oh, Jesus <gasps> Christ. Oh, no, not? he's just gonna cut him down. Right? 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 He's just gonna cut him down. Okay. Okay. <laughs> so nervous. God, son of a bitch. <sighs> Yeah, these, this guy. Quiet. Nope, do not throw dirt. He's gonna help you. 
helps if you close your eyes. Oh, oh. What are you doing? Stop. Help. Help. Tastes bad, don't it? It's for your own good. Okay. What are you so do now, girly. Okay. We made it to the end of another chapter, and this time with the tarot card. That actually is how it feels. <laughs> so, then, what have we the got? star? It's the star. Stars. Stars and light. Stars. Beacons of light. Dreams of hope. Or a reminder of our insignificance. Fear of despair. Trust in the light of the star. With it comes clarity. And sometimes truth. Remember, there's always more than meets the eye. Would you like me to show you? Yes. See more. Last time we did this, I didn't understand any of what it meant. That's... Emma, no idea what that was. It looked like Emma, she had her phone, she turned on the flashlight maybe? There was something bloody and then... Back to Hackett's Quarry you go. All the fun you'll have. Will we though? Will we have fun? Mm. Alright. Oh, looks like we're playing as Ryan again. <clears throat> Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and leave it there. So yeah, I'm, I really don't think that the hunter guys are the cause of what's going on. Clearly there's some kind of like creature or beast or what was it? Like dog, Silas the dog bo boy or something like that. Um, so I think they're just out there hunting whatever it is. And I think they're actually probably trying to keep the kids safe. Um... I don't know what the blood has to do with it. So what I thought initially, because last time I ended the stream, we saw the big guy in the overalls and a shorter, older guy. They were putting up the hunting season sign and they had like covered themselves in blood. So clearly the blood has something to do with it because he just covered Jacob in blood to, I think, keep him safe. I thought it was so that you could like, I thought blood attracted whatever the monster was and that they were trying to hunt it. But maybe it helps like obscure you from its vision. And I don't know if it's like human blood or like the pig blood or some kind of different blood. Um, he seemed to have it, oh, he had it in a vial. And we did find one of those vials in the tree near the cabins and somebody was like oh it was abigail who found the vial and she was like oh it smells awful and so i wonder i don't know because now i'm trying to think through it also the cop from the prologue was really trying to get max and laura not to go to camp a day early so clearly the people who live near there or something know what's what the deal is and maybe they're trying to help the kids and keep them safe so i think maybe if we see somebody who's not the monster and who looks like a human being that maybe it's they're safe unless of course they are shapeshifters but why would that guy help jacob then and i really do think he was trying to help nick like i really do until nick bit him i think he kind of looked like he had like maybe like pressure on like his carotid artery or his jugular or something. I don't know why he was like pulling him by the neck. That's not a good idea. But I think he really was trying to keep him safe. And I think he is the person who had the shotgun who helped shoot the beast off of him. But yeah, I'm going to leave it here for the night. And I guess we'll see what happens next time. I'm so excited. Um, like I said, I, I've been kind of wanting to watch other, um, other people streaming this game. 
And so I feel like now that I've finished a little bit more, I can kind of watch a little bit more of several other people playing it. Um, it's kind of nice. I, I'm i torn because I really want to watch other people play, but at the same time, I've mentioned it a couple times tonight where it's like, I really want to go back and play through it again for myself and go back and see all the things that I've missed. Um, but yeah, I don't know. I guess we'll see how it goes. Uh, I might watch some other streamers and just as long as I don't play ahead of or watch ahead of where I'm currently playing, I think it should be okay. So anyhow, um, yeah, I'll try and stream again probably next weekend, maybe like Saturday night or something like that. I tried to do it this Saturday night and I can't remember what happened, but I remember being super tired and I think I like fell asleep on the couch. Anyway, um, thanks for joining me. I hope you guys are enjoying this and I'm really having fun. So it's nice to be back to streaming and I will see y'all again soon. All right. Bye.